As daylight dawns on planet Dota, a wild techie catches a glimpse of his reflection in the river. The techie, upon realizing what he looks like, hurls himself to his death. Meet the breed known as Silencer, one of the wisest species to have ever existed. These creatures' unparalleled intellect lets them avoid death with relative ease. Deep in the jungles of Dota, there is a tribe of men known as Storm Spirits. These primitive beings believe in higher powers and perform many rituals to their gods. Here you can see one of their men sacrificing a donkey to the river gods, asking for the strength to kill his enemies. Unfortunately, the gods are too busy looking at Dawnbreaker's thighs to pay attention to Storm Spirit. However, Storm, not knowing this, still stops to ask the river gods for help instead of running for his life unfortunate. This causes the storm to decide that the gods are angry with him. He must now make a grand sacrifice to them and begins to slaughter creatures of the jungle for the next 10 minutes. You can see the silence's mind racing at a thought a minute. These creatures truly may be the dominant race once we are gone. Techies historically are not strong animals. I've seen one fight a child stuffed bear and suffer defeat, so they must rely on trapping in order to feed themselves. But due to the fact that the brain is equivalent to that of a blended potato, once they begin to set a trap, they lose focus on everything. The minimap, their teammates, and their own well-being, until the tedious task is complete. The loss of a friend will have been worth it when the techies can finally kill and eat an unsuspecting prey. The Takis, upon experiencing failure, doesn't know what to do, so he falls back on his evolutionary instincts and does what thousands of Takis have done before him, kills himself. Meet O.D., a naturally nurturing creature, albeit an easily confused one. He constantly forgets what his name is and makes up a new one every couple of weeks. This species will do anything they can to protect their allies against their enemies, however, they just sometimes forget which is which. The OD, worried that Abaddon was in danger, puts him into a protective bubble. What a good friend. The one benefit of being the offspring of four generations of inbreeding is that God can't help but pity you and toss you a lucky break every now and then. Techies will eat good tonight. A great chase between species, predator and prey, race for their lives. Storm, after massacring a rainforest worth of animals in sacrifice to the gods, is confident they will protect him, even in the face of Taki's traps. But he underestimated the almighty, universe-bending power of Dawnbreaker's thighs. Here, we observe the vicious species known as Shadow Fiend stalking his prey. It turns out that an animal made entirely out of shadows can't see very well. In this shot, you can see the shadow fiend trying to flirt with a tree, who he thought was an attractive female of his species. Looks like she rejected him. In a fit of rage over getting blue balled by a tree, the shadow fiend proceeds to destroy the Dyer's Ancient, completely ruining a part of a very delicate ecosystem we call home. This has been your Planet Dota. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe for weekly videos and head over to Twitch to see clips like this. <laughs> Boys, I pissed on the floor! Woo, baby!